about the crowd in this place tonight. What an atmosphere. Preacher Star! I'm looking forward to seeing you next year, helping us up like you always do. Can't wait to be back at the garden next year. Hope to see you all there. I can't wait to see all you guys back at the garden supporting us and helping us win games. Looking forward to come back next year and see you at the garden.
a wonderful night for hockey. From far above center ice with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich. Ray Ferraro is ice side. We'll hear from him shortly. October, first month of the hockey year and a great time for a strong start to the season. With thoughts on this, here's Eddie. The fans are ready, that's for sure. We're kicking off the regular season with a tremendous amount of energy. These two teams will need to settle it down early in order to walk away with the win. They've checked with the goal judges, they've checked with the referees, they've checked with the goalies, we've checked with the fans. They're all leaning forward, we're ready for the face-off and the start of a brand new season. One-timer, save! Both of them got all of that one. Looking to Gronlin. Gives it to the point. Swept on to Yossi. Intercepts that pass, maybe he can generate something. He's got this one and they're after him. Save there. Play stop, so I turn to Eddie and he points to Ray. You're on, man. It's like a little trailer to a movie when you watch East vs. West. You get a little bit of what could be a smorgasbord, which is the Stanley Cup Final. Thanks very much, Ray. The puck's dropped, and that's a great job tying the man up on that faceoff. Points it. Many yards gained to Forsberg. Propelled to Yossi. He's got the puck, but he needs to get it out. Takes it in from the neutral zone. What a hit that was! He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. Let's it go. Say. It's a good pickup. And they are in. Brings a shot. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Brian Johansson, a former first round draft pick of the Columbus Blue Jackets, the fourth player taken in the 2010 NHL entry draft. He's going to remember his first NHL goal because it was a game winner. A little over five minutes have been skated so far. Still scoreless. Nashville's prevailed on another faceoff. The Predators have it along the side at mid-ice. Let's it go. Wonderful save on a terrific scoring chance. Nicely received at the point. Looking from the corner. Strom's tripped and a penalty should be coming. Nashville's got two on this one for tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. New York's power play will have its first chance of the game. I loved going on the power play early in a game. You get to handle the puck, you get to make some plays, really get you into the game. Carries it on in from center. Feeds the point. He missed the net. Sometimes it doesn't matter that you hit the shot that hard. That puck is drilled. He just misses the net. It's dumped in. Up that right side to VC. He takes that point pass. 
Gathered up again by Irwin. Great job of keeping that from going out. Oh, and a great opportunity denied by that pass. That puck sailed out of play and went out over the glass. Nashville's fans sitting behind their net got up and showed their respect by bowing to him after that huge save. The Rangers with a win at center. Driving in from no man's land. Box loose, the roadblock got in the way. He's got that point pass. Really good job by the defenseman there. And that one has cleared more time off that penalty clock as they drop back and wait for another rush. Gets the pass through to start a play. A neutral zone interception. Using the point, he's got it. A shot! Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. You gotta think that's a game-changing save there. Nice work done with the stick there. Pitching it to Buchnevich. Canes that offensive line. Let's a shot fly. Score! A power play goal! And it's a biggie! Sometimes when you score first, you take the edge off your own team. That can't happen. You're up one. Go make it two. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The Rangers control from the faceoff. And that puck landed in the bench here. And by number 77, Anthony D'Angelo. Time of the goal, 8 minutes, 38 seconds. A little under 9 minutes have gone off the clock. The Rangers lead 1-0. It's dropped. They lock up, and that's a good job by the winger. This is a tough one to work for. That's a good solid poke check. Puck is thrown to Brickley. The Rangers skate it up on the side. And he dumps it in. And he picks it up. Outstanding job done at the blue line to hold the pressure off. Through the corner. Bumped off. Flings it. Wonderful stop. Snapping a pass to Houghton. A shot! Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. Laid on to Torres. It's dumped in. Moving it to Ellis. Passing one off now to Torres. Pass attempt to Yarncroft. Lots on that to Mark Stahl. Brings it in for an attack. Fires! Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. The goaltender shuts that one down in a superb opportunity. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Johansson. The Rangers are driving it from the wing. pass in his own end is able to move on in really good cut of the pass and now it's directed to Simmons trying to go to Buchnevich a whistle offside is called Pretty easy stop. Once he's in the butterfly, he can slide side to side and control the rebound.
and the faceoff's won. Crosses that line. Couldn't do what he won. Taken over again. Use that stick like a magic wand. To Boyle. Directing that one to McLeod. Near the last minute of the first. The Rangers have the puck at center ice. Back to the point. In the first period. And sent down to Stroll. Took that away in his own zone. Wonderful work done near the blue line. Pitching this one to Watson. Gains the zone. Trying to get it back out there. Intercepts that pass on the attack. First period stats are final. We'll have some more entries as the second and third periods are forthcoming. The Rangers are the only team to score, and they did it once. Every playoff game, our team score brings you our item of the game. Stay warm and stylish here at the rink. With the Rangers have a one-goal lead. This is the one that did it for them, as the teams are in the locker rooms, and we're about to sell some. Our start tonight is just 10 bucks. Hurry, as supplies are limited. One period down, another period beckons here. What did you think of the first? Nashville's coming out of the intermission knowing they didn't have a lot of possession time in the first. If they get on the attack, they will open up more scoring chances. Gets across, looks over his options. Popped loose because of that hit. Looking to Forsberg. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Pitching it to Buchnevich. The Rangers have left the defensive zone. Gathered up again by Kreider. Smart recovery by Yossi. To Arvidsson. Perfect pass, tape to tape. He's got it at center ice from right wing. Pass off the woodwork, the Gronlund. On to Ellis. The rookie's looking for his first goal. Great save! Puck is thrown to Zibanejad. Leads that charge into the zone. And down to Kreider. Slides it to the point. Shot! He scores! <laughs> Get this close to the goaltender, the puck on your stick, you gotta snap it quick. That's a great finish, but this play starts back with the puck carrier. He makes an excellent pass, opens up enough room for him to shoot the puck. The Rangers have now enlarged their lead to two to nothing. At the rate they're going in this game, they might make it three fast. Rangers the faceoff, the tie-up, and a solid job from the winger there. Assisted by number Played in the corner by Shaggy. Snapping a pass to Ellis. He's got that one measured in the attacking zone. The big pillows came in handy. Smart recovery by Smith. Moving it to Simmons. Cut off that pass in the neutral zone. In with it now. Pucks loose went off someone. Good solid defensive play with the stick. Gets that one on a cross. At least he protected his goaltender. That is up close and personal. That hit will change the momentum of this game. Scooped up by Shattenkirk. The play has been blown dead. Hard to understand why at this point. Turris delivers a perfect hit, lays out his opponent. The Predators get the draw. Pass. 
pass cut. Steps across that line. Shoots one. Outstanding offense met by solid goaltending. Huge hit in open ice. If you're here to watch physical hockey, well, there you go. Couldn't get through. It's loose. Slid to McLeod. It's one of those restraining fouls. It's a hooking penalty. And the arm of the referee is up. The Rangers guilty of a minor penalty for using the stick blade. Just a hook. Uh, more times than not, Doc, anytime you reach in around a player's hands that has the puck, you're going to get a hooking minor. Nashville's getting the edge for the first time tonight with a power play. Always important to win the special teams battle, or at the very least, come out even. They must retreat and start back again. Onside. Chip to Torres. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. And down to Torres. Fires! Not on the net. I know that shot had a lot of heat on it, but if you put a soccer net there, it wouldn't have hit it. The Predators go back so that they can come back on this power play. Good shooting place. Use that big goalie stick well. Just a bit under nine minutes to go. The Rangers are ahead two to nothing. They lock up from the draw and the teammate puts the grab on it. Trying to get rid of that puck. The Rangers get a minor penalty for delay of game. Well, all he was trying to do, Doc, was shoot it off the glass and get it out of the zone. Unfortunately, it went into the crowd. A five on three power play. It may seem like a sure goal, but sure things are never sure in hockey. One of the biggest problems on a five on three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. Great job on a cut pass. And now, after that period of time, we get the whistle and the penalty call. The Rangers have a delay of game penalty for shooting the puck over the glass. That's a very frustrating penalty, Doc, for everybody. The player did not mean to shoot the puck out of the rink. The Predators are presented with a great opportunity here. It's a long five on three. You don't get too many chances like this, Doc. A five on three power play. The key is to be aggressive, get the puck to the net, make those three penalty killers move all over the place. Passing one off now to Gronlund. Steps in from the neutral zone. Shoots one. Gotta clear it here. That puck is cleared and fresh guys can get back out there. Pass attempt to Gronlund. Propelled to Forsberg. Long lead pass to Yossi. Say! Receives that pass from the other side. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. New York's fans got back on their feet after watching the replay of that massive save on the big board. I don't think we're going to see a bigger save than that the rest of the night. Nashville's quick on the draw. Outstanding save, just on reputation. You can smell a goal there. As soon as the goaltender reads the release of the shot, he drops to the butterfly and makes a really easy stop. that face off from the tie up the help came score got it with the man advantage oh i like the way this power play worked they broke into the zone nicely 
they were able to move the puck around and they cash in. The Predators, with the scoring of that goal, have cut the lead in half and still an entire period to play. Neutralized face-off win. Laid on to Eckholm. Lifts the stick and steals it. Cleared out of the zone, they get ready for another attack on this power play. On to Smith. Let's it go. And a save. Under seven minutes still on the clock in the second. So they have scored. The deficit now is one. Nice face-off work. They've taken the heat off again. The clock still moves. Now it's directed to Eckholm. Nashville's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. What a tremendous hit. You gotta love that hit, unless you're the guy on the receiving end. That's a jolt. Big drive! Oh! In his very first game, his first ever goal. Doesn't get any better than that. He gets number one in game number one. I got a feeling that puck's going to be in his trophy case awfully soon. Well, that's a backbreaker, a shorthanded goal given up. You have the power play, you think you're gonna capitalize on it. They give up a chance and it's in the back of their net. And so, he's helped his team. He wants to help them even more. Get that second goal, very first game. This is impressive that he could do that. The Rangers control from the neutral zone. Oh, what a hit that one was! Yossi's skill is known throughout the league, but when he throws his body around, everybody takes notice. 34 seconds. This always makes the fans stand up and take notice. What a crunching check delivered. Critical win of the draw. Great save. Right near the goal stripe to Johansson. Gives it over to the point. Loose puck did not go very well there. And he dumps it in. Trying to go to Forsberg. And he steps across the line. He cut that one off in the defensive end. Now a little bit of a sloppy turnover, Doc, but that looks like a guy just trying to make too much happen. He wants to get his team back in the game. Gathered up again by McLeod. Read that play in his own end. Stays out low off the post. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. Shot on. Outstanding save with a glove. And so you did this too, your first National Hockey League game, your first National Hockey League goal. Man, you dream about this as a kid. It's like you can't even feel the puck off your stick. Before you know it, it's in the back of the net. The Rangers win it. Things are heating up with that hit. If they keep hitting like this, I'm not sure how much they'll have left in the third. Directing that one to Boyle. Nashville's looking to head man up the wing. Slid to McLeod. Skill play by Boyle. No way he's getting by there. Pitching this one to Buchnevich. Looking to get it out. Looking to Yarncroft. Pass cut by the offense. Got that in the trapper. Cloud's skating ability allowed him to really put a lot of force in behind that big hit. Good face-off win. No luck getting through. Puck loose. Pitching it to Yarncroft. 
can start the attack going in the zone. Puck is thrown to Buchnevich. New York's winging it at neutral ice. Intercepted that one at an important place. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Clean win on the draw. 40 minutes have been played. Some hits given, some shots fired. But let's see what they have in mind as we get closer to the start of the third period and crunch time. Let's check out the shots on goal through these two periods. 16 for the Predators, a lucky 13 for the New York Rangers. The Rangers end the period with a two goal advantage. We focus on this one, the one that made it two goals and we'll have more in just a moment. Forty minutes have been played. They are getting ready for the third period here. So take us back through the game. What do you think, Eddie? Nashville's coaching staff, Doc, has to be pretty pleased the way they played through the first 40 minutes of play. One area of concern has been their offense. They need to take advantage of all the time of possession and finally put the puck into the back of the net. A howitzer! Score! And it's a one-goal game! so far up here, Doc. I'm not sure if that puck got deflected. Let's go down the ray and see what he saw at ice level. Not only was the puck deflected, Enzo, it's through traffic as well. You're going to see on the replay that the goaltender's fighting A, the traffic. He's got to get into position for it. Right when he thinks he's got the puck at him, the puck changes directions. He just can't catch up. The Rangers with a center ice face-off win. He takes that pass right off the left wing. Got that one ahead at center ice. Around through the corner. Nice tip of the pass. What a marvelous collision. Unless you're in it. Everyone heard that hit. Snapping a pass to Arvidsson. Moving it to Zabanejad. Passing one off now to Yossi. Pass attempt to Forsberg. Bodied off. And now it's directed to Strom. Trubas looking to leave. Chip to Faust. Oh, what a stop. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. That puck's loose. He couldn't get through the roadblock. Propelled to Shea. Blocked away. Lobs it. Waffle boarded. Steals that pass at center. Has it back deep. Puck free, roadblock by Simmons. Trying to go to Faust. The Rangers are skating it up at neutral ice. Turned a shot on net. Score! He's got his second of the game. Goaltender was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on top of him. I don't know how he could be in much better position, Eddie. I got a clean look at this. That is a perfectly placed shot. A little under six minutes have passed. At this point, some good offense, some strong defense. Six goals, it's 4-2. By number seven, the Rangers Jennifer with a Beck. neutral zone possession along the way. Truba, time of the goal. Five minutes, 41 seconds. Driving down the wing at center. Nice work by Shattenkirk. That one comes right on his stick. Not very long, but good. Shoots it off. 
say. Held there for a face-off coming up next. There's always satisfaction when you cross a round number. 100 points for him is a nice start. Won that face-off. Now what? The Predators keep the play going in the middle. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. Yarncroft's headed to the penalty box. A minor for tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. The Rangers go on the power play again. They have connected once already. They should be really confident as they enter the power play again. You've already got one power play goal in your back pocket. You'd like to do it again. Eight minutes, 17 seconds. Back and forth they go between the points. Just couldn't make it. That puck's loose. Good defense. In all alone. Muscled long to D'Angelo. Terrific determination by Shattenkirk. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. The puck is under him and the play is blown dead. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. him on that one. Got his pad on that one. Fires! It's dumped in. To Buchnevich. Played on to Zibanejad. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Directing that one to Yossi. And he dumps it in. Took it up the boards and holds. He's got that pass at the point. Pitching this one to Torres. Stood him right up. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. Oh, that's good. What's his next move from behind? On to Shattenkirk. Score! What a power play these guys have. Puck looked like it got deflected right in front of the goaltender. I'm sure Ray had a much better look at that. It did get deflected, Eddie, and when we get a look at it on the replay right here, you're going to see the goalie's in position, but because the puck is deflected the way it was, it gets past him in a way he just can't react to. We have passed the 10-minute mark of the third period. The Rangers just keep building on that earlier lead. Their advantage is three. Assisted by number 22. Gathered up by Ellis. Skates it into the zone. Fires nearly grazed the iron on that. Well, that's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. Paddle aside. And he holds on and stops playing. It's one of the most grueling calendars in all of professional sports, Doc. Players are playing through injuries night after night, travel, but the best teams find a way to win regardless. Lots of great hockey in store for us over the next little stretch. Up to the point. Did not go very well that time. Loose puck. The Predators are at the wing in neutral ice. To the point it comes. Lid to Forsberg. Tosses it. Didn't miss by much. When the puck sounds hard when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. Puck out of the zone and the attackers regroup. Takes it in from the neutral zone. He throws it there. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. 
chip to Forsberg. Defensive gem with the stick. Looking to Mark Stahl. Right near the line, can he keep it going? Takes that pass. Took care of that one. Pitching it to Arvidsson. Fires. Oh, a save there. They score! They only trail by a pair. This snapshot surprises everybody with that quick release, and he's got himself a good goal. Lundqvist's trying to cover the bottom of the net, but the puck beats him anyway. The Predators have gotten this game back to a two-goal deficit for them. There's still time here in the third. Let's see what happens next. Nashville's got that one, now what? It's dumped in. A good stick there, so score! First game, first goal. Welcome to the NHL. How about that playing in his very first game in a National Hockey League, and he lights the lamp. Congratulations, something he'll never forget. This only happens once in your career. Ray, we both know about this. And this is one that he's going to remember the rest of his life. His first goal in his first season. Well done. And so play about to resume here. And he's still in euphoria. He's got his first goal in his first game. Wow. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Big collision and open ice. You have a hit like this, there will be more to follow. 56 seconds. The Rangers up the wing, lock the puck. Let's a shot go. Save there. And freezes play for the whistle. Boyle's taken a huge hit, but he's continued to make the play. They won it. Now what can they do? Puck out of the zone. And so they'll regroup. Shot. Gloved. Snares it with the glove. Big face-off win here. Let's see what happens. We're in the 60th minute out of 60, or will there be more? The Rangers skated up on the side. Using the point. Shutout positioning by Kreider. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. Missed all of it. And we get a penalty. The referee to the table, a player to the box. Nashville's given a minor here for tripping. Now oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. The power play has been well oiled. They've connected twice already. Let's see what develops Nashville off this faceoff. A critical faceoff, and they won it. Now what? Good defensive read with that one. Terrific determination by Faust. The Predators empty their net. He's at the bench. Net empty. Score! It's his third goal of the game. A hat trick. That one should put the icing on the cake. That's going to be too much for them to come back from that empty net or seal the deal.
Nashville's got another face-off win. The Predators have to take a chance here. They pull their goalie. Compelled to Shea. Net empty. Score! net goal will send the fans to the exits. Everybody can exhale a little bit now. Once the empty netter goes in, that pretty well wraps it up. And they take that neutral zone face off. Shoots one. Wonderful stop. The horn sounds. This one's over. The Predators lose big. But not a good effort at all, especially in that third period. The Rangers raise their sticks to salute their fans. And that takes care of game number one. It is a long season ahead, but a season designed to entertain hockey fans. We hope you enjoyed this one. We did. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good evening.